heard i've heard of how land banking could help our people become millionaires and billionaires over, yeah. overnight so how how is the best way to go about this and how do one recognize the right location okay um land banking is still one of the um safest cost uh, less uh, cost effective, effective as far as um, real estate investment is concerned so you buy somewhere mm. right having understood what is coming there understanding for instance the government attention in that place okay what is going on what is projected to happen in this place within a specific time right so if it's a plot you can buy or two or an acre you buy it confirm ensure it's not uh, it's not under any government and mm-hmm. grant ensure it doesn't have a court um, a litigation, litigation or yeah. any issue yeah. on it you can confirm it's for you to pick your coordinator get your surveyor do the right check yeah, exactly. go to land right exactly buy it when you buy it keep it if you have the money to fence it fence it if you can't fence and you are sure that okay i bought it to, from someone that is genuine right Buy it, keep it, just wait mm. and see what will happen. It's not, it's not like magic, it's because you have already known what is coming there by projections. Do you understand? And when you, you, are, you are starting not to sell it at the same amount that you told, I told. I have showed a receipt of a property that I wanted to buy somewhere. So the owner of that place showed the amount to bought some 5000 there. 75,000. Yes. And how much is, does it work now? So they were, were negotiating 25 million. No, I'm, I'm very sorry. We're negotiating 25 million. From 75,000 naira 75, to 25 million because he has a foresight. When they told some people to come and buy in that place, they said it's bush. Mm. I can tell you that 75,000, it was not it. Was not six. It was a bush. Mm. It, to buy land with 5,000 yes, 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 it wasn't a city. Yes, it was a bush, yes. But the man saw, and I like him, he keeps record. When he wanted to reset, he showed us the amount he bought it. He bought it. Wow. Do you understand? He showed us the amount. So, um, that's land banking, the, the, ensure the, the location by location, where, where is the place? Zierquek, Zierbeju, this is maybe Atkorodu, Ikorodu, Imonta, yes. all those areas, you know, myself and my assistant were talking uh, about what is happening in Imonta, because we have a property in Imonta, yeah. and we're just looking at people who are saying, it's far, it's far. We know what the government is doing in that area. The Fort so, Milan Bridge. The Fort Milan Bridge, the um, rice, the rice mill, yeah. the, the ferry, you know. I think I was hearing uh, that last quarter two is becoming a university, yeah, like that they come to the university. I, I don't know, I think they've known the I think they've they 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 right? Because I, the one in uh, the family attack the last word. Yes, it's not last word. It's not last word. So, last word has been. So, these are the factors that you consider, you know, how because of the things government is going to do, it's going to bring about migration mm. of people. People will come here. Mm. Where people, where two or more people are, there's money. Mm. Where you can see two or three people, there's money there. Exchange must happen. Exchange must happen. So with this thing that the government is bringing the the migration of the people, you are sure that people will need where they will live. They will need where they would um, do all that stuff. Yeah. To live. Yeah. Migration is one very key thing that that causes wealth transfer. Yeah. Yeah. So sir, apart from Lagos, I want to do land banking. I don't have much. Mm-hmm. Where else do you think one can go for now that you have seen that this place will be? The one I know of, we have land in our town. And we are not expanding in that place because of uh, this town. It's because of this movement. Mm. I cannot tell you how many times we have, we have closed acres upon acres and we are still expanding. Mm. The demand is high. Yeah. So, for instance, Owode, Owode, Atonota, Atonota, Ibadon. Yeah, but that was crazy too. Um, this these areas outside that after Lagos, you know, the altar because they, they have, have proximity with proximity Lagos. With Lagos State, so Owode, uh, where else? Where else? Owode, yeah, those are those places. Yeah. awesome locations. Yeah. Would, bro, really, the 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 corner, the people are Owode, 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 Aton, Aton altar. 
Those people are really coming there is crazy. I realize that um, most of most of people that works in Lagos uh -huh. uh, already have properties in Ota. Yeah. Because they come from Ota to Lagos because there's nowhere else to buy on the mainland. Where else? So Ota is an offshoot of Lagos. So they, they, they go there and looking at what we trust the government to also keep doing, you know, ease in, in transporting. Yeah. Make people moving with ease. So yeah. I can leave Ota and I can say I'll be in Ikeja or I'll be in Oshodi by so so time and I'm mm -hmm. there. Mm -hmm. Do you understand? So those areas, they're strategic and they are places people should be a part of. All right. All right. Yeah. Thank you very much.